The Stearns really embody to me the expression beautiful inside and out. When I think of them, Tim and Julie and all four of their girls, I think of people who have just beautiful souls, a wonderful way of living in the world, and are beautiful on the outside as well. They bring a lot of joy to many, many people. We're honoring Tim and Julie Stern for uh, their commitment to the J. It's such an honor, but I'm sort of like, I mean, it's an honor, but I'm like, I we're don't too know. Young for I'm this? so no, yeah. Like we're now old, and I'm like, I don't know. I'm like that person did more, and that person. Uh, I'm not surprised they want to honor you. How about that? Julie certainly has a lot of energy. That's for sure. They both do, and uh, it's an energy and a drive uh, as well. And anything that they get involved with, they really do give it their all. So I think I always wanted to be on the board of the J. And I kind of saw it as like something like to work towards. To be as involved as she's been for as long as she's been is really, uh, I think, pretty unusual. Julie has really been an inspiration to me. She taught me the importance of getting involved in the community. And <laughs> um, and she, she has set a standard for me that I am trying to equal. Wow. That's the sweetest. Yeah, I'm sweet. Uh. <laughs> I definitely think they're proud of this honor and being involved. I'm really, it makes me so happy that they're proud of it because they have worked so hard. I was not involved uh, with the J or the Jewish community um, until Tim uh, really uh, encouraged Tim and Julie. We went on uh, a mission trip uh, with them and really um, kind of saw that uh, energy that they had for the Jewish community. And, uh, and, and I think once they, they get involved with something, um, that's, they, they commit to it. We all want to feel connected in some way. And it's hard to find like a place where you can feel connected. And, you know, I know that the preschool then, like, goes and does activities with the um, elderly and the adult daycare. Those that are doing the in program, they are also interconnected um, at the J. And I just think that people want to feel connected. And I think the J is a place they can do that. You never know when you're gonna need something like that. And I think they've helped build something that's there for all of us. You know, I spent most of my time at the J in the, um, in the workout area, uh, but it is, to Julie's point, it's a great place for, uh, for everyone to get together. And you know, I imagine that when I get older and, you know, like my kids are gone and let's say in another 15 years that it's like, I'm just gonna wanna go to the J just to be there. And you know. We'll drop you off. Right, exactly. But no, I think, you know, we're thinking of that. I mean, they really are role models. They, um, I, I think when you see their leadership, um, their energy and the commitment that they have, uh, it really is inspiring. We think it's important for everyone to help support the community and this event. From kids actually being able to go to the, um, the day camps or Sabra or the daycare or the preschool and the J provides the funds for, for families who are in need or needs just need just a little. And so part of our you know reason for giving is to help everybody participate in the J, because not everyone has the capability of, to be able to do it. We support the community as a whole, no matter where you're from, what you look like, or what you do. And I think that's as important, um, the impact that the J has on the community overall, as it is on what it does within the Jewish community. You know, it's our duty, this is our responsibility to whether you use the J or not, it's the single most, um, it's the single agency that pulls Jews from all over the community. 
um, whether it be orthodox or really just non-observant. You know, I different would, ages. Yeah, different ages, and I would say that I would fight to keep the J, you know, thriving. And then Tim just has to do it because I do it. 